Okay, so today I'm going to guide you through your assignment. Well, I'm going to get you started with it at least. So you're going to go to Microsoft Word. You're going to be creating a new document today. So it'll take it just a few minutes to open. On your computers, you go to the Start menu. From the Start menu, you'll open um, Student menu. From the Student menu, you'll go to Microsoft Office 2013. And then you'll get to here. So you'll choose Blank Document. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do is we're going to type your first name and the header of the document. To get into the header, you're going to double click up in the margin and you're going to left align it. So we're going to click on the home ribbon, left align, and it will be amber. Okay, so the next thing is I'm going to show you how to put your name in here. So to get out of the header, you double click in the lower portion of your document. So everything should be left aligned. So I'm going to type my name going down. So it's A, enter, M, enter, B, enter, E, and after every letter I pressed enter. So here's what we're going to do. For each one of these, you have to use a different font size. I'm sorry, you have to use the same font size, which is 50 point font, but you have to use the same font size, but a different font. So here, let's just say we're going to choose Broadway. The A should be 50 point font. So I just click on it and I type in 50 and it will make the A a 50 point font. However, for the corresponding parts, they should be 20 point. So ambitious, that's something that describes me. Um, I don't know, I'm not very good at this. Attentive. So I have to put in um, one word, sorry, one word, and then I'm going to use the thesaurus to come up with two synonyms. So to use the thesaurus, I'm going to highlight the word. I'm going to go over here to review, and I'm going to click on thesaurus. And it, as long as the word is highlighted, it's going to automatically look up words for you. So then it's found words. So I click over here after ambitious. I put a comma. I'm then going to add two words, determined, they do not have to begin with a, determined and let's say aspiring. Okay, so now we're going to go down to the M. The M has to be 50 point font, go back to the home ribbon. And then I have to change the font for all the letters after M. So we will use motivated. Because I am a motivated individual. So for the thesaurus, I'm going to come right over here and I'm going to type in motivated. And I press enter. Over here, you see it's come up with all kinds of synonyms. So I'm going to choose two synonyms. So I will choose encouraged and inspired because I am very inspired by things and people okay so you get how we do it right you have to make this one 50 point now this one I have to choose a different font because I used Calibri for the second one so here let's just use Bay House this font size has to be 20 and I am bright so I'm going to go back over to my thesaurus I'm going to type in the word bright press enter and there are my synonyms so bright will be cheerful and positive okay so you get the hang of that all right now I'm going to show you how to insert clip art so we're going to go to insert, we're going to choose pictures, sorry, we're going to choose online pictures. Okay, so what we're going to search, I want to search something that is aspiring. And I'm going to press enter. It's going to pull up things. So if you want to show all web results, click show all, and it will show you everything.
let's see if we can find one that I like that feels aspiring to me or not okay so I'll choose another word I would choose these words that are very good but very hard okay so I like this one succeed determined that's me so I'm gonna click on it and I'm gonna click insert now when I do that it's gonna put it down here but I don't want it to be there I want it to be over here near my name so I'm gonna click on position and I'm gonna choose this second one position top square with text wrapping so I'm gonna shrink it down so then I can take it and put it right where I want it to go okay so let's do another one super quickly insert online pictures let's put motivated oh, I like this super girl she's kinda cool okay so I'm just gonna resize it first and then we're gonna go to position we're gonna choose this first one and then I can move it right where I want it to go so yeah, I could put it right there, right near it. Okay, so you're going to do that for every letter in your first name. Um, the margins, so you're going to go to Page Layout. You're going to click on Margins. You're going to click Normal. That means the margins should be 1 inches all the way around. When you're done, you need to save this as a Word document. And you need to upload it to Course Sites for grading. Then you also need to come back and save it as a PDF. Save it to your Live Binder. You'll be creating a new tab under Live Binder. It'll be under Microsoft Word. And you will name it um, Thesaurus and Font Activity. So I hope this helps you. Um, I'll go ahead and knock these last two out. So I'm going to pause this video and knock these last two out. Okay, so this is my finished work. Now, this is a good example of what you should have. There's also an example on course sites. If you have any problems, give me a shout. You should have one piece of clip art for each letter in your name. You should have three words on each line. Each line should have a different font, a different, um, and the letters of your name should be 50 point font, and the words should be 20 point font. So, I hope you enjoyed today's assignment and have a great day.